Hello. Today I will show you how to include a dummy variable in your regression equation. A dummy variable is also known as indicator variable, binary variable, design variable or boolean indicator. A dummy variable is an artificial variable that is created to represent an attribute with two or more distinct categories or levels. To explain how to create dummy variables in SPSS, we will use the car seat status set. In there, we have sales as our dependent variable. For simplicity, we will choose quality of shelving location as an independent variable. But note that, quality of shelving location is an ordinal variable. It has three categories. Bad, medium and good. These categories are represented by 0, 1 and 2 respectively. In the data view, you can actually switch between these numbers or original categories by clicking the value labels button. Creating dummy variables means creating multiple binary variables from the categories of a categorized variable. For example, we have quality of shelving location variable with three categories. We will select category bad as a reference category. We will not create any variables corresponding to this category. We will create binary variables for rest of the categories. That means, we will create one variable indicating whether an observation is either medium or not. Similarly, we will create another variable indicating whether an observation is either good or not. To create the variable indicating whether an observation is either medium or not, we go to transform and then recode into different variable. We click on the old and new values button. Remember that in quality of shelving location variable, 1 means medium. In old value, we will put 1. In new value, we will put 1 as a value for the new variable. We click add to add this as a condition. All other old values will be converted to 0 in the new variable. We press OK and come back to the previous menu. We assign a name for the new variable and press change. This new variable name will appear in the box in the middle. We press OK and a new variable will appear in the data view. Change the decimal places as you do not need two decimal places for this variable. Also assign the appropriate value labels in the variable view. In the data view, you can check the variable values by clicking value labels button. Similarly, we can create another variable based on good category. Remember that in the quality of shelving location variable, good was denoted by 2. We assign all the old 2 values as 1 in the new variable and 0 for everything else. Once these 2 variables are created, we can put these 2 dummy variables in the regression equation to predict sales. The coefficients corresponding to a dummy variable is known as differential intercept coefficient. We can interpret the regression coefficient for each dummy variable as how that category compares to the reference category. In our case, bad was the reference category. We can also add another continuous variable, such as, price in the same regression equation.